Uh, the next thing that we talked about in lesson one was this laying our left hand flat across the guitar and just playing some rhythm. So we had that left hand not pushing down. We had this kind of muted string sound. Okay, so hopefully you've been kind of jamming along to some of your favorite albums because remember the right hand is really just kind of a drummer and it's just playing rhythm and just kind of doing its own thing. Um, so what you want to do as well is be sure that you'd maybe throw some up picks in there and some down picks. Um, remembering to keep your hand as loose as you possibly can. Uh, you don't want to have what I call robot arm where you just kind of move your arm like this and your wrist is really stiff. Relax your wrist and let it come from there. Um, so here's some different things you could try. Uh, just try to jam along with me for a second if you can't think of your own. So here we go. Down, down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down. Okay, try to fit that into your favorite recording of your favorite band or put on the radio and just kind of have fun. Uh, here's another one. I'm going to go down, 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 up, down, up. So it's going to be down, 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 up, down, up. Down, 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 up, down, up. Okay, so try those to your favorite recording uh, and then just keep expanding, loosen up. Think about uh, what it's like once again if you were going to dance to the song or if you were tapping your foot or banging your head or whatever it is that you're choosing to do, uh, think about what moves you and try to follow along to that.